I just made a right. It depends on which way you would be coming from. And that's how we uh, start this video. Rise here. We find ourselves in uh, Queens. Find ourselves in Queens, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Cause uh, in Queens, Forest Hills, Queens, to be exact, there is something very awesome. I'm gonna make a right here on 69th, right across the street from the McDonald's. Two-way street, so let's be careful the way we're driving here. But there is a house on this block. We're going to turn around here. So there you are. This is a pretty cool thing here. If you're a Spider-Man fan, Back from the movie in 2002, Spider-Man, uh, Peter Parker's house was uh, this house right here. Right here in Forest Hills, Queens, as uh, it's known. That's where Peter Parker lived. Uh, they make it evident. Then the 2002 uh, film, Spider-Man. The house right here, uh, if you could see it, it's 88 um, on 69th Road, Peter Parker's uh, house. Back there where this uh, car is, back there where this car is, is where you would have uh, the backyard. And Mary Jane's, Mary Jane's house is like directly right next door to Peter Parker's. It's Mary Jane's right here, Peter Parker there. And, uh, you know, in the back alleys, they had their famous conversations. Obviously, you do not want to go down the, uh, the back alleys. So here's Peter Parker's, Mary Jane's house. Pretty cool. Spider-Man 2002 film. As we continue down, uh, this is the neighborhood of, I like to always give you a little background of where Peter Parker, if he really was, you know, in real life. Living in Forest Hills, this is how Forest Hills would look like. Uh, you know, the home that we've seen for Peter Parker, you know, those homes, uh, you know, those are common homes um, around, uh, you know, Queens. That, that's about, not to get into too much of real estate for you, but that's about, um, I don't know, about uh, 1,200, uh, maybe about 1,200 square feet. Usually you have a basement uh, that's either finished or unfinished. Uh, depending on the area, obviously, that you live in, you know. Those houses probably, you know, they're, and then they're usually uh, single family homes. You know, that style home that you've seen. Uh, it had, you know, the first floor, second floor, and then you had an attic. Uh, so those homes are usually, um, going uh in and around a uh, price range of about uh 650 7 675 7 725 uh forest hills at least the further down we go maybe even higher um, all in close proximity too if you've been uh if you're a big fan of um King of Queens, All in the Family. That's, you know, pretty much where in that um, area. Of, uh, the, the shots were from, from those homes. The Coopers, uh, the Coopers Bar. 
uh, all within close proximity. Everything was close proximity to each other here. So, all right, guys. Adios, ciao. Very uh, nice area here. Parking by permit only. Beep, 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 beep. Take the next right toward Woodson Street, then turn right onto Woodson Street. All right, so you're just kind of getting a 500 feet, turn right onto a scan avenue. Askin Avenue, it's S. Askin, turn right onto a scan avenue, then it... turn right onto Greenway South. Very narrow streets here. Oh. This right here is, in the comics anyway, Aunt May's house. Pretty cool. And right across the street, is would be the home of the right there the home of the green goblin norman osborne it's a real life name there now, you know, it's a connected home obviously and uh as we continue on See, this is a very private street, a uh, very narrow street. Like I said here before, these homes are worth a uh, pretty penny. And, uh, you know, if, you, if you're living in one of these homes, and, uh, you know, you're, you're definitely, uh, I think you're uh, definitely winning. Both homes, actually, uh, as you've seen Aunt May's home. What? So yeah, as a, a coincidence, both uh, the Goblin's house and uh, you know, Peter Parker, home, uh, Aunt May home, they were both actually owned uh, by a Parker family and an Osborne family. Not sure if that's the case now still, but how about what coincidence is that? Wow, mind blown, right? And uh, you know, this is some of the uh, back streets here of um, you know Forest Hills. A lot of uh, iconic uh, you know, movies.